We present a quality assessment metric that predicts the perceived visual difference between two images or videos. It accounts for spatial and temporal perception, as well as peripheral differences in perception across the field of view. Our goal is to design a full reference visual difference metric, so we always compare a test video to a reference. Since we operate on inputs described in physical units of luminance, our videos are first processed using a display model. In addition, the size of the display and the viewing distance are used to model the viewer's effective retinal resolution. The luminance map is decomposed into sustained and transient temporal channels, which model how our vision's temporal responses behave. The two channels are converted into Laplacian pyramids, and each frequency band is encoded in units of physical contrast, which are needed for psychophysical models. Finally, the difference between each band is calculated using a masking model and a spatiotemporal contrast sensitivity function. The resulting values can be displayed as a heat map to help users visualize the regions where the videos will appear different, like the ones shown in this video. The values can also be pulled together to obtain a single valued quality score, which is scaled in perceptual units of just objectionable differences, or GODs for short, and can be used directly for visual computing applications such as optimization or learning. Because of the lack of video quality datasets with foveated rendering artifacts, we created a new dataset with controllable stimuli, which contain artifacts due to sampling, reconstruction, and filtering. Our dataset explores how quality of rendering varies with speed, luminance, and contrast in a foveated rendering scenario. We calibrate and test the parameters of our model over four distinct datasets, which include over 400 video pairs and 4,000 image pairs. These datasets provide insights about the perceptual quality of spatial and temporal artifacts across the field of view. Our first principles metric achieves the best predictions across all datasets when compared to existing methods. There are many applications for our metric. In particular, it can be used to evaluate the visual quality of images and videos for different viewing conditions, like changing frame rates, compression settings, or artifacts like blur and noise. Since our metric supports peripheral vision, it can be used to select sampling rates for a streaming system that transmits and renders foveated 360 degree videos like the ones in augmented and virtual reality displays. Finally, our modeling of peripheral temporal perception enables us to create better algorithms for immersive displays, such as subtle gaze direction systems. Here are some additional results. We invite you to read our paper and supplementary material for details about our work. Thank you for watching.